bombardment having smashed the Jap defenses, the landing barges go speeding to shore with American Marines camouflaged for jungle fighting. The invasion of strategic New Britain, the large island across from New Guinea. At the other end of New Britain lies the great enemy base, Rabaul, which is the ultimate goal of this amphibious operation. The going for the motorized equipment is wet. From the landing on through the watery marshes so typical of the rainy belts of the tropics. The miasma jungle through which American fighting men toil in the drive that seizes the tip of New Britain Island, a moist and soggy island. Motorized equipment leads the assault against the Japs. And in the tank and infantry tactics, the soldiers advance behind the fire-spitting armor. has wiped out the Japs at the tip of the island, where strategic airfields have been constructed by the enemy, captured flying fields to be turned to American use. And amphibious operations are launched against the Japs in New Guinea, landings that outflank enemy positions on the coast. There is a close connection between the Allied drives on the nearby islands of New Guinea and New Britain. And this landing under fire is part of a large concerted plan. Jap forces trapped by Allied troops who drive to wipe out the enemy. Flying fields the Japs built are now bases for Allied air power, which raids afar and hurls the destruction of blasting fire. base at Robol is virtually neutralized by the unending series of bombing assaults. <laughs> 